I think one, one of the things as a photographer is you generally, a lot of people want to get hired as a photographer. And there's this sort of limbo that happens between when you are not getting jobs and yet you're taking good photos, but you want jobs, but how do you get jobs? And the element, one of the things that came out of probably the, like something that one of my instructors when I was taking photography classes left me with, he was a working photographer, said the hardest thing that you're gonna have when you get, out of, when you get done with school is self-assigning and the importance of self-assigning and creating the type of work that you want to be shooting or you want to be getting hired for. And the type of work, something that I say often, is like the type of work that you put out, the type of work that you create and put out in the world, whether that's on your Instagram feed, on your website, like that's the type of work you're, you're going to attract. So how can you set up the type of shoots that you want to be doing, that you want to be like actually getting paid for and create that work. So we set up a shoot today working with a stylist. We've got hair and makeup done. We've got a modeling agency, a model, and going to be going through a handful of looks provided by Style by FEA. And they've got some really, really good looks pulled. And we're doing this like it would be hired for a brand and shooting in a lifestyle sort of way. Gonna be shooting a couple different cameras and it's gonna be a cool shoot. So let's play around and see how it goes. Loading up the Contax 645, which is my main camera. What is so great about this camera besides this 80 millimeter lens, which I love, is the fact that you can load up and have preloaded rolls of film. It loads real quickly. So this one is the Pentax 6.7. Gonna have this one loaded up. Put in some more Portra 400. Get rid of this guy. So a big reason why I thought this would be an important video to do is that I, I find it's, a lot of people wanna be making their career, making their living as a photographer, or just making some money as a photographer, getting hired, right? How do you get hired? And that element of what do you what do you do from being a person who like either wants to take photos or like, yeah, you take good photos, or maybe you even got a good following on Instagram, to then actually getting hired for jobs. And I've been a pro photographer full time for probably 15 plus years. And with that, like there's a big hustle that comes with it, but really this element of of shooting the sort of stuff that you want to be getting hired for. And that's what we're doing today. I put together a team and we are working together to do this really neat lifestyle shoot in a sort of a vibe that I really enjoy shooting with then and I have shot lifestyle for companies, but that's what we're doing today. So much of the way that I'm shooting is dealing with where the light is. Typically, I love either of my subjects to be backlit or side lit. And so right now, the sun is sort of off at a 45 degree-ish angle to where our lovely model is. And it's gonna be really gorgeous.
the nice things about film and shooting something like this is like you hit the end of a roll and you sort of know like, okay, that was the last shot and then we can move on to the next thing. And it, for me, it always gives really nice little breaks in between um, shoots or sessions or whatever it is that we're sort of moving in between. some of the SX-70 color film from Polaroid. Fun, and just see how you can get with some color. Never litter, folks. Hoping that was a good encouragement for you to just get out there and shoot. There's no excuses, no excuses. So get your own team. Whether it's like you get out there and you're asking every modeling agency you can find, wherever, whatever area you're in, like Google your city plus model agencies, best model agencies and find them and put together your own mood board, put together your own design, create a team and then reach out and I bet you're gonna get some good responses. So there's, there's lots of ways to do this, no excuses, but have fun in the process. Just shoot with your friends. Like that is the easiest, lowest barrier to entry. Go shoot your friends, but it's more just this, this encouragement to shoot. Get out there and play. That's how you learn, that's how you grow by doing. So yeah, we love having you as a part of this community. Thanks tons for watching if you got this far in the video. Um, yeah, but we're here for you, here to support you. If you have anything you wanna learn about, leave comments below. We are a shop, Film Supply Club, so you can get cameras in the shop. We have 645s like this, we've got 6.7s, we've got the Pentax, the Contax, we've got all sorts of stuff, um, and the best film prices you can get. So hope to have you in the club, and thanks for being a part of this community. We'll see you on the next one.